Hey guys, today we've got another property segment. Uh, we're in the area of Black River, near the Black River Gorges. We're looking at an awesome property at 276 square meters, the house on 1,460 square meters of land. It's a three bedroom, three bathroom property uh, with an office and also gym area. The price is 975,000 euros. The monthly levies are 175 euros a month. So let's take a walk through and have a look at the property. Okay, so this is the entrance. You've got a sliding electric gate here. Really nice. It comes through with like these vines hanging there and you'll see as we walk through here, you walk through these, these vines and you come through into the main property. Nice little footpath. Neighbors are cutting their lawn at the moment. <laughs> uh, we've got a storage area for kayaks. Um, there's boats, kayaks, everything that stay over here. Um, undercover we come around here this is the main entrance you're walking down the footpath so you've got a nice mango tree here we come in again and we've got these beautiful flowered vines that are about to flower on the main entrance here okay we've got another sliding door on the side there just to get airflow through the house and that goes to the corner of the property I'll take you through there now so let's walk through into the house okay this is coming into the main property here we're coming into the lounge living kitchen area just to give you an idea of the size and space and one thing is it's all not even double volume it's triple volume so you'll see the I'll zoom up here for you guys you can see how high the roofs are here you got windows up there that, that give you awesome airflow that the air comes into the area okay here's your kitchen very well appointed kitchen awesome granite tops well finished kitchen huge fridge nice huge window that we just opened here that lets air in from the garden through the whole property if you walk around the back here we've got a pantry area i'll take you into the back pantry okay there's your pantry we've got shelving in there there's a washing machine in the corner there's a step ladder and then there's another door entry door into the pantry from outside so okay we're heading back into the kitchen so as you can see on this property upstairs here, there's a whole upstairs area there that's glassed off and there's an office up at the top there and then there's a gym area with mats and yoga balls and that. We'll take you up there and show you now. So let's, let's go into the main living area. Okay, so here's the main living area. You've got your outside seating area. You've got an awesome little area you can sit and eat dinner, lunch and breakfast out here amazing pool have a look at the garden out here there's some beautiful trees growing in this garden so really a well-established garden look at that pool that pool's got a jacuzzi it's a jacuzzi pool so first time i've seen that where the whole pool's got bubbles coming through it so we switched it on to show you guys got a nice outside day gazebo here with with uh, lounges where you can lie and there's towels in the box there for the swimming area Turn around you and look back at the house. Okay, you're going to see the beautiful mountain in the background as well. So you're right on the back of the mountain here, which is there's no neighbors behind you. And this is a private property and it's actually a hunting ground. So there you have deer and stag and that that actually come down to the back fence. We'll take you around there now and show you the beautiful living area outside. Huge trees. We've got a lot of banana trees there. You can actually see there's actually bananas on the tree at the moment. Quite a lot of fruit trees in this, in this property. There's two massive bunches of bananas about, and a third one about to drop now. So your own fruit, always a good thing. So let's walk through here. We're going to walk around the back of the property. Let me take you through under the gazebo. Okay, there's the, the perimeter fence over there. You have no neighbor on that side because that's a hunting ground. Um, there's a patong court here. People love to play Patong. It's the ball, the game where you throw the balls. It's like a big marbles game. And um, this is, yeah, this is all private land here that's never going to be developed. That's a hunting ground. So you, you get uh, deer and stag and pig, wild pig that come right to the fence here. Um, there's the back garden with more mango trees. We've got some more banana trees there. We've got pawpaw trees. There's a pawpaw tree over here with a few pawpaws on. Um, and there's a little herb garden at the top. So there's a lovely pawpaw tree and yeah let's let me see if I can jump up here and show you okay so that's 
all the hunting ground here. So that at, in the evenings you'll see the stag will come down to the fence here and you'll have deer at the back of the fence eating, eating and grazing here. And then there's a herb garden here with irrigation in the back, back fence. Okay, let's go back into the property. I'm going to head through the garden again. We'll go in the front entrance and I'll show you the bedrooms. So yeah, pool pump here at the back of the property, hidden away. Let's go through the garden here. Once again, very lush garden. Beautiful bougainvilliers and... Okay, so we're going to go into the main, back onto the veranda. Veranda has two ceiling fans, one there for the dining area, one over here for the lounging area. Okay, there's the main lounge area with, a, with your main TV. The, the unit also has a projection screen, as you can see along the, along the edge here. There's a projection screen over there, so you can have a projector. And let's walk through into the passage. Just going through into the passage, and then we've got a secret kicker at the end here. This, this unit's got a basement, so that can be used as a wine cellar. So this is bedroom number three. Can be used as a guest bedroom. Lovely size bedroom. Got its own opening onto the garden again. I'll show you here. So sliding doors that go out onto the back garden, onto that back fence. Okay, massive bedroom. And then it's got its ensuite bathroom here. So ensuite bathroom, sink there, toilet there, and then there's like an indoor outdoor shower here. So there's the shower. And it's got a lovely little door opening onto a private garden. And there's your outdoor shower. So it's got an indoor and an outdoor shower, which is really nice. In hot summer months, you, you probably shower outside. Okay, let's head out of bedroom three. Probably the guest bedroom. We've got a nice little seating area here with a window. If you want to come lie, read a book. Guest toilet. So there's your guest toilet, guest loo with hand basin. Okay. Here, here we go, the stairs going up to the office area. Let me show you that. And you've got a beautiful big glass window here with a stone wall looking onto the garden, letting a lot of light in here. So we're going to head up these stairs now. This is the stairs that are looking onto the main living area. Okay, so if you look right here, they've got some yoga balls and yoga mats and weights. You've got windows here that opens fresh air into the top of the house. And you can see that view out there. That's your view down onto your swimming pool area. Okay, so we're gonna turn around here to give you an idea of the office area. There's the office area. There's two desks set up here, one, two, and a lot of space. And once again, another another window this side that outlooks onto the back of the property so you can get fresh air coming in here again. Okay, so let's head on to the other bedrooms. I'm gonna head back down the stairs. Let's head down here. Okay, going down to the main passage. Okay, we've got bedroom number two on the left here. So, we go left here. There's the second bedroom. Also a really nice cool bedroom um, with opening up onto the swimming pool. So this is a stunning bedroom. Um, also, you've got these vines growing down here off the trellises. You can see these beautiful vines growing here. And then if you look through here, let's go through these vines. Have a look at this. There's the swimming pool. Okay. Back out here. Okay. Bedroom again, main bed, huge size. And then ensuite bathroom. There's the ensuite. There's your basin. Toilet. And yes, another outdoor shower, indoor outdoor shower. So there's your outdoor shower over there, and then there's your indoor shower over there. So all bathrooms have indoor and outdoor showers, so that's three outdoor showers in the property. Okay, we're going to head up this second bedroom, head towards the main bedroom now. Okay, this is coming into the main bedroom, we've got built-in cupboards on the right, big solid wood. Built-in cupboards. 
privacy wall here and then here's the main bedroom looking onto the garden again with sliding doors another atrium door over there more windows stunning size bedroom more cupboards at the back here so i'll show you there now got a seating and dressing area over here more cupboards behind the bed there's a wall separating and another window letting in light at the back here so cupboards probably hers more cupboards his cupboards and then coming onto the main bathroom so the main bathroom you come through there's the main toilet over there uh, it has a sliding door for privacy and then you walk onto the main bathroom You've got a massive walk-in shower double basins and then this another massive outdoor shower there's your outdoor shower over there and if you're feeling like having a chill moment with a glass of wine you have your bath outdoor bath here in the garden beautiful shell shaped bath and another atrium garden yeah you can see how the garden goes around you yeah, beautiful this is stunning okay guys so that's the property um is available to foreigners to buy And uh, we'll publish a price. I'm going to take you. There's also a public swimming pool, uh, like a play area for kids, and a public uh, swimming pool area that we'll take you to, and you can have a look at. And um, yep, yeah, that's it. Okay, so guys, the one thing that I did forget to show you, I had to go back and do now, is the basement. So this is a, just an absolute bonus area. You could turn it into a wine cellar. You could turn it into a movie theater. Um, down here, into the basement. More storage under the stairs. And the light's not great in here, but this is uh, the size of a double garage over here. We don't have a key to get in there. Put my torch on. So there's a massive area for storage of bicycles. There's paddles in here. There's fishing rods in here. But this could be a, uh, easily be a movie room or something similar. So guys, one more bonus, the property, there is, a, there is a communal swimming pool as well. So if you um, have kids that want to go down and meet their mates at another at the, at the communal pool, we're going to walk down there and we'll show you that area next. Okay, so now we're walking out of the property, we're going to the common area. Just to show you, at the common area there's a swimming pool, there's also a gym there, and there's an area that you can reserve if you want to have functions. So if you're having functions like you're having a birthday party or a kid's party, um, there is an area that you can reserve uh, for, for those things. So we're gonna walk down here. We're heading towards the common area and then there's guest, uh, there's guest parking for visitors. Okay. Yeah, so there is visitors parking here. Here's visitors parking bays if you have visitors coming along to. Okay, so this is uh, the main entrance, the security entrance. This is the main gate you come in to the complex. And then you head through here. This is the common area. Coming into the common Boma area. And big area here that you can reserve. There's a bar counter area that if you want to have functions here, you can. There's a kids trampoline. And then there's a massive pool, guys. So there's a massive swimming pool for the complex. This is a common area complex, so the kids can come and play here and make a mess and make a noise. And this is the place to be. So yeah, that's the common area. There are 27 units in this complex, and uh, that's the clubhouse. You and me stuck on the ocean now, nothing but waves in this villain in. I want to dry up, but you just keep on going, don't you? I don't even know how we got here, all my reasoning have disappeared. 
I wanna bury the hatchet and find the way back to our home, our home, our home. We don't have to drift inside this dome. I will not let us fade away. It's not a price I wanna pay, and it's not too late. No, we lost our purpose, chasing all that surplus. You were all that I need. I feel that we can break free. We can still go back there to a place with no cares. We can turn this ship around. We can turn this ship around all the way back home. Chasing all that we do not care. Chasing all that we don't care. Chasing all that. Ourselves. Didn't have much, but nevertheless, we were true to each other. But now we don't even bother. I remember you being hopeful, but the tall waves have worn us down, and slowly we are drowning. That's why you need to come with me, with me, with me. Turn around 180 degrees and cross the sea. I will not let us fade away. It's not a price I wanna pay, and it's not too late. No, we lost our purpose. 